What if I told you that everything you've been taught about personal growth is actually keeping you stuck? The morning routines, the hustle culture, the endless self-help books, they're not the key to success. In fact, science proves that some of the most common self-improvement strategies might actually be making you worse. But here's the catch. If you don't know what's broken, you'll keep repeating the same mistakes. That's why today, we're exposing five of the biggest self-improvement myths that science has completely debunked and revealing what actually works. The last one is the reason most people never change, so don't miss it. Lie number one, a perfect morning routine will change your life. Imagine this, you wake up at 5 a.m., drink lemon water, meditate for 20 minutes, journal your goals, and then feel exhausted before the day even begins. Sound familiar? We've been told that morning routines are the secret to success, but what if they're actually ruining your productivity? Research from Harvard Medical School proves that your chronotype, your body's natural energy cycle, is genetic. That means some people perform best in the morning, while others hit peak focus in the evening. Yet, self-improvement gurus push the 5 a.m. club as a one-size-fits-all strategy. The reality? Forcing yourself into an unnatural routine leads to decision fatigue, burnout, and worse performance. Instead of trying to copy billionaires, optimize your schedule around your own biology. So the real secret? Stop chasing the perfect morning routine and start designing a day that works for you. But what about working harder? Does that guarantee success? Well, lie number two. Hustle harder. Success requires working 24-7. You've seen the quotes. While you're sleeping, someone else is grinding. But here's what they don't tell you. Overworking doesn't just burn you out, it actually makes you less productive. A Stanford University study found that after 50 hours of work per week, productivity starts to decline, and after 55 hours, it flatlines completely. Even worse, lack of sleep reduces cognitive function by 40%, meaning the harder you work, the worse your performance becomes. The world's most successful people don't hustle 24-7, they optimize their work. They use 90-minute deep work cycles and take intentional breaks to maintain peak productivity. This isn't lazy, this is how the best in the world work. So ask yourself, do you want to grind endlessly or do you want results? But wait, maybe you just need more knowledge, right? Lie number three, reading more self-help books will make you smarter. Be honest. How many self-help books have you read this year? Now, how much of your life has actually changed? Here's the shocking truth. Reading isn't the same as learning. The Ebbinghaus forgetting curve proves that 90% of what you read is forgotten within 30 days unless you actively apply it. That means most people aren't improving. They're just consuming information without action. Successful people don't just read more books. They apply what they read. Instead of jumping to the next bestseller, do this instead. Summarize key takeaways in your own words. Teaching helps retention. For every book, apply one key lesson immediately. Reread with intention instead of chasing more content. Knowledge isn't power. Applied knowledge is. But maybe you just need to stay motivated, right? Wrong. Line number four, motivation is the key to success. Have you ever watched an inspirational video or attended a motivational seminar only to feel fired up for a few days and then lose momentum completely? That's because motivation is a chemical reaction, not a success strategy. Dr. Wendy Wood's research at USC found that 40% of your daily actions aren't driven by motivation at all, they're habits. The most successful people don't rely on motivation. They build systems that make success automatic. Instead of hoping to feel motivated, do this instead. Use habit stacking, attach new habits to existing ones. Set up your environment to make success easier. Example, if you want to read more, keep books in sight. Identity-based habits, instead of saying, I wanna work out, say, I am an athlete. Success isn't about feeling motivated, it's about showing up, even when you don't feel like it. But what if you're just not that kind of person? Lie number five, your personality is fixed. You can't change who you are. How many times have you told yourself, I'm just not a disciplined person? I've always been shy. I could never be like that. This is one of the biggest self-improvement lies of all time. The Big Five Personality Traits study proves that personality is not fixed. It evolves based on habits, environment, and self-image. 
A 2020 study from the University of California even found that people who actively work on self-improvement see measurable changes in confidence, discipline, and social skills. That means you can train yourself to be disciplined, you can rewire your brain to be more confident, you can become the person you've always wanted to be. Your identity isn't set in stone, it's shaped by your daily actions. Who you are today is not who you have to be forever. Final takeaway, what you need to unlearn today. Let's recap. You don't need a perfect morning routine. Optimize for your energy, not the clock. You don't need to hustle 24 seven. Work smarter, not longer. Reading won't change you, taking action will. Motivation is unreliable, systems are everything. Your personality isn't fixed, you can change who you are. Now here's my challenge for you. Drop a comment below and tell me, which of these self-improvement lies have you been guilty of believing? And if you're ready to take your transformation to the next level, watch out to my next video, The Science of Identity Shifting, How to Become Your Future Self Faster.